Welcome to Achiever, the Language Cert International ESOL B1 level qualification. Let's look at listening, the first component of the written exam. The listening component of the Language Cert International ESOL written exam at B1 level consists of four parts. All texts are heard twice. There are 26 items to answer. There are two different item types, multiple choice questions for parts 1, 2 and 4. Each multiple choice question provides three options, A, B and C, and filling in gaps for part 3. Gaps are to be filled in with no more than three words each time. Part 1 consists of seven short and related utterances each followed by one multiple-choice question. Here, candidates are asked to understand context, meaning and function of a range of utterances and are asked to answer seven multiple-choice questions. In Part 2, there is a task which asks them to identify a specific aspect of three conversations and answer two multiple-choice questions on each. Part 3 asks candidates to extract key information from a monologue to complete a notepad with seven gaps. Each gap needs to be completed with up to three words. Finally, during part four, candidates are asked to follow a discussion between two speakers and answer six multiple-choice questions on it, each with three options. At B1, the listening component lasts approximately 30 minutes and, remember, all answers must be written on a separate answer sheet. This is a sample of part one where candidates are asked to hear seven utterances and choose the best reply to each one of them. They may hear a statement, an explanation, a description or an extraction. This example is characteristic of part two where candidates listen to three conversations and are asked to identify topic, purpose, context or relationship between speakers. They answer two multiple choice questions per conversation. This task from part three asks candidates to extract information from a monologue. It may ask them to listen to a radio broadcast, talk, narrative, presentation, and identify specific information. They are required to produce seven responses, which should be no longer than three words each. This is a last example taken from part four, where candidates hear a conversation between two speakers and need to identify gist or opinion, purpose, key ideas, or attitude they respond to six multiple-choice questions. For all tasks of the listening component, candidates are awarded one mark per correct response and can collect up to 26 marks. Here is a sample of the candidates' questions booklet on the left, listening tasks in the middle, and the candidates' answer sheet on the right. For more information on this component of the exam and for support materials, simply follow this link.